Improbable. Impressively, Cardinal Hayes is a state football champion. It was the first time Hayes ever won a state championship. First time a New York City Catholic school has won a state championship. It feels great. They celebrate. They survived. Cardinal Hayes is built on one thing. It's built on belief. Despite so many obstacles. Your chest puffs out a little bit more when you're one of the last teams standing. Hayes worked to be the last team standing in New York. If you're not first, you're last. They were last place just last year. Coach C.J. O'Neill's team was still reeling from COVID shutdowns. The pandemic negatively affected inner city kids more than it affected it. It did. All right, there is no if, ends, or buts about that. It hurt. We had to kind of shake the pandemic off us last year. This school from the South Bronx has had to shake off more than most, coming from a neighborhood with New York's highest poverty rate. Their home field was unplayable, neglected by the city. So Hayes spent this season on the road, facing suburban rivals with bigger budgets and better facilities. Resiliency, you know, and I think that's something that we built a lot on. Built up, lifting rusted weights outside on a field with no lights. Run like it's a fourth All week, quarter. practicing until dark, then marching along the Metro North tracks to finish under Mott Haven's lights. Obstacles? Here, they play through them. I feel like Rocky at the end of Rocky too. you know, just trying to hold on to the rope and, and throw a couple more punches. October brought a real gut punch when a player smelled smoke in the football office. I was like, pull the fire alarm. It's, the room is obviously on fire. But we'll clean. Fire destroyed CJ's office, but not his team. With as much damage. As Seeing the charred walls, the coach saw hope in the haze seal untouched above his desk. The seal wasn't damaged. What did that tell you? We're working on a little higher uh, higher authority at times around here. And Hayes felt it with the playoffs on the line when Rich Beelan, the son of a pastor, heaved a last-minute prayer. Yeah, goes long. I thought he was going to say I was out because I did get one foot in. Charlton in the back of the end zone. Did he catch it? He caught it. Touchdown, Hayes! <laughs> that led to this. Cardinal Hayes winning a coveted title that no inner-city school has ever won. A title that nobody expected them to win. We spoke a lot on changing the culture, helping each other, trying to develop each other, make people, make each other better people, not even just football players. Sure, a championship is sweet, but for these coaches, change is the real reward. You get to witness the change, and you get to see people's lives and families just, you know, just go on the upswing. It's moving just to see it all, you know, come together. John Chan, News 4 New York. Congrats. This is my favorite story of the day. Yes. Kudos to the they boys. Fought hard for that. Awesome. That does it for us. News 4 at 5.